good social scientist. So, technical education per se shouldn't be just focused on this thing, but it should be multidisciplinary. It should, we should not function, function like silos. A mechanical engineering faculty doesn't talk to computer science. Computer science fellow doesn't talk to uh, social scientist. Management fellow never talks to anyone. So each one thinks their discipline is superior. But if you really want this to happen, you have to integrate all the disciplines in some way or other. And why innovation is important? If you look at state of Telangana, I have been in this space for the last six years, looking at higher education in Telangana. And when we see, one of the areas we found was we should make the educational ecosystem focus on innovation, out-of-box thinking, creativity. Again, Mr. Prasad, I quote, predictable teaching, predictable learning, predictable exam, predictable marks, predictable jobs. This has to be broken. We have to disrupt this. Fortunately, under the leadership of our Honorable IT Minister, Mr. K.T. Ramaraogar, we are trying to look at giving a gap year. Today you read in um, one newspaper, Bits Pilani is giving a one gap year. Why should an engineering student continue four years like that? If he has a brilliant idea, give him a gap year, he will go innovate, fail, doesn't matter. Because in India, we don't value failure. We should celebrate failure. I have failed many, many times. Not only in exam, in life also. What I wanted to do, I could not do, but I did something else. So, we should tell our young people that falling down is part of a baby steps. When you were a baby, you fell down many times. You broke your um, things. But in higher education, we want everybody to excel without doing the internship. Again, I compliment Sri Buddha Chandrasekhar Garu, with whom I have a very close acquaintance. That internship should be encouraged. Industry interface should be encouraged. Faculty from industry should come in. Professors of practice. Why should our, our professors not go into industry? I am telling, I am sending my faculty now. I am saying if you get an industry job, go for six months. Doesn't matter. Your API, I will take care of. And too much focus on API publications, good or bad, Nai Sadakwala publication, we call it. You know, you go to Delhi, there's a place called Nai Sadak. You can get any publication done by evening. You can get marks, you can get promotion. But we are not here to get promotions, we are not here to get some medals. We are here to make our students excel. That is the contribution of a teacher. I also have one more small, I can't say dig, but I can say definitely reference to the top institutions. The supposedly top institutions, if you look at, they get the cream of students. It is very easy to manage a cream of IIT fellow, he is the IIT material, he will get into IIT. In spite of the teacher, he will be successful, let me tell you. I don't say IIT, IIT. but what about the rural universities? I now have heading a university with 8,500 students, all brilliant. But how many IITs have worked with us? Now we are opening that channel. If Indian universities are not coming forward, foreign universities are coming forward. I now am going to sign agreements with top companies, top international universities. The reason is we have not thought beyond. A Chinese university may come tomorrow. Singapore, if you know, is a small country. In one day you can go two times across the country. Three top universities. NTU, National University of Singapore. Uh, uh, there's another one in management. So. I will go on and on, you know, nowadays, because uh, for a professor, if a mic is given, it is difficult. And I'm also out of classes nowadays. So I can go on, but I don't want to. I just wanted to bring to your Sindhu, I can see Dr. Sindhu, Professor Sindhu, and many more. My only request is both to the teachers, I don't know, you might be in degree program, you might be in management, you might, but my request is let us work together. And without a goal, uh, we cannot achieve it. So if we can put three types of, three goals for ourselves in the next five years. In fact, I have written a perspective plan for the government of Telangana. It's called the Perspective Plan for Technical Education, PPTE. I'm not a technical expert. But as an outsider, I had to put in a word, take advice of Govardhan Garu and people like that. That is the best technical plan for any state which was endorsed by the former AICT chairperson. Because a new person like me, without any polluted idea about any idea, educational, technical education. I just sat down, put experts like Professor Sriram Venkatesh, like Prasad Garu, and put up a small plan related to the state plan. 
and now we are going in that. Last thing, people talk about curriculum design, curriculum change. Most of the curriculum changes we do, whether we like it or not, is what we like to do, not what the industry wants to do. Unfortunately, this is a fact of life. But if we can industry, at School of Management, University of Hyderabad, I'm very proudly saying, because I was there and I'm still there, though I'm on deputation. We had two board members from industry. So Chitra Ella was there, we had Amitabh Guha, we had uh, many more, and we also had gender. We went, we were particular that a woman see Vanita Datla was there. Every year we were used to have two years, one board member from in the two board members. And we used to put our curriculum to them, ask them any more changes you want. And they used to tell me, believe me, 20 years back, I had a professor of practice in my department. Not now. From Sierra Atlantic, we had a person who came and taught. We gave him credits for it to help from the project management. Uh, so I can go uh, on many issues. So one is we'll work on internship. I request people like Professor Prasad, you are welcome. I'll invite you to also Basa and other places. And we also invite retired faculty. They are big source of knowledge. In India, unfortunately, somebody reaches 60, we say he's retired. But a professor is never tired or retired, like our DVG Krishna. So uh, I have a great uh, uh, association with all this. And I am willing to even participate in this program of how do we build when internships. I will take you to the Honorable Minister along with our Secretary. And we can launch Renovation Take Care this year. I request our Honorable Minister, Sri Jayesh Ranjangaru, and our Minister, and other Vice Chancellors from JNTU, Usmania. We'll all form a small group and look at technical education, general education, and give small projects. Okay, next area is gaming, animation. So many areas will come. So I'll stop here. Uh, I will have to leave actually. We have a convocation next week, next Saturday. Exactly our five days to go. And uh, But I thought a great initiative from Renovision. I will partly and definitely support this initiative and we will work together. You can put together no rank, no designation, no this thing. You can have a matrix organization. In a scientific organization, there is no uh, professor, senior professor, because senior professor doesn't talk to lecturer, no. But unfortunate part, we have to actually mentor them. So um, I think we should have a matrix organization where we should have free flow of ideas and then we should present a small come out with a small document. I will take that responsibility of integrating this with the state government and also if need be, we'll go to Delhi and sit with the AICT and the chairman UGC is planning, uh, supposed to be here next week. When I meet him, I'll definitely also come with this. Thank you very much.